I'm currently setting up a retail business, and I'd like to produce um, a private label um, mm -hmm. underneath my own brand. However, there are I'm more concerned about the minimum orders and things that happen because I'd be doing things in small batches. How do we deal with that? Because in China, you know, you're dealing with huge numbers, mm -hmm. and I just can't I can't deal with those kinds mm -hmm. of things at the moment. Um, do you have any insight into sort of small quantity <laughs> manufacturing? I do. Uh, can I think? Can I? Oh, sorry. You can, no. you, you're welcome to answer that. I was going to throw it over to Stamo. Stamo, do you want to answer that? Or? Uh, most factories in London deal with small quantities mm. because nobody produces huge quantities. We, I take a docket of one piece. <laughs> <laughs> can I and just, I go up to 50, 51. We just can I just ask, because my experience of dockets of one is that you're, you're, you'll be charged a sampling price, yes. which is at best times one and a half, one, one point five, or it's five. either times two. On some occasions, it's times three. So I'm going to ask Stamo, is that how, if you get a docket for one, yes. do you charge we, a production price or a sample price? When I, gave a, when I give a production price, I give from one to 10 pieces, 11 to 20, and it goes up. So the more pieces they will bring to me to produce for this particular style, the price will go down. But I, do, I can make one. 